Hello, in this video we are going to we are going to look at the solution to the first weekly math challenge question. So we have a right triangle and it's going to be 3, 4, 5 right triangle because 3 squared plus 4 squared is equal to 5 squared and we want to find the shaded area. So we we can find the area of a triangle. What is the area of a triangle? That's 1 half times base times height. And our base is, we can let our base be 4 and we can let our height be 3. So it's going to be 1 half times 4 times 3, which get us 6. So area of the entire triangle, which is, which is the entire thing, is 6. So if we can find the area of a circle, if we can find the area of the in circle, we can subtract it from the area of a triangle and we should have our answer. And to find the area of a circle, we need to find the radius of the circle. So how can you find how can you find the radius? And you know there are, there are two ways of doing it, and I am going to show you both ways. First way is to find in radius using the formula a plus b minus c over two. This only applies for right triangle. This only applies for right triangles. So let's try this out. In this case, c is the hypotenuse, and a and b are two other sides. So we have three plus four minus the hypotenuse of 5 divided by 2, which gets us 7 minus 5, 2 over 2, which is 1. So in this case, in radius comes out to be 1. And it, it should always come out to be 1, actually. And second way is the way that works for all triangles, every single possible triangles. And it is area of a triangle is equal to in radius times semi-parameter. And semi-parameter is parameter of the triangle divided by 2. And what is the parameter of the triangle? It's 3 plus 4 plus 5, which is 12. So semi-parameter is 6. So this thing is 6R. And you know it is going to equal to the area of a triangle, which we already found to be 6. So radius is 1. So either way, you should get the same answer of radius being 1. So what is the area of the in-circle? So what is the area of the in-circle? That's going to be pi r squared, and since r is 1, it's going to be pi. So to find the shaded area, we are very close to being done. All we have to do is subtract. Subtract the, the area of the in-circle from the area of a triangle. So the answer is 6 minus pi. That's the answer to the first weekly math challenge question.